with HALO, which is a hybrid fractional laser, then you really get the best of both worlds because what HALO does is uh, basically uses two different wavelengths to uh, make tiny little entry points into the skin and that stimulates rejuvenation. So what you see is a diminishment of fine lines, pore size, all the surface damage that we tend to accumulate over the years. So it's really great. Again, it enables us to rejuvenate areas of the body outside of, of the face, which has of course been our our mainstay for the years, but we're finding more and more interest in these these off-face procedures. With the halo, it depends entirely on the setting. You can do a very light setting, in which case, I mean, in a day or two, it's, it's nicely recovered. If you're a little more aggressive, it takes several more days than that. Of course, if you're using halo and BBL too, for that matter, you really want to make sure that that person has not had significant sun in the weeks ahead of the treatment, because you're going to add a whole bunch of additional target to the light energy if you do. If you do a cluster of several treatments, usually separated by four weeks, maybe anywhere from two to four, and then maybe maintenance six months to a year. Someone with a lesser degree of damage, you might do a treatment, and then another one, say, six months down the road.